yoga teacher training day 11 here it comes Mwah. puppy i'm pregnant with tacos and ice cream oh my gosh ow open up your arms let it go good morning guys it is almost six o'clock right now it's august 6 monday and i'm heading to vanguard key club to train one of my clients this morning then i need to go back home to grab my food i woke up a little late today so i didn't get to pack up all my food but it's ready it's just sitting in the fridge but i just didn't have enough time to pack it up so after my client i have to go back home to grab my food it's beautiful it's 64 degrees fahrenheit it's perfect perfect so last night I was able to read um, one of the sutras books and it was very fascinating. Alright, we're here. See you guys when I finish. Bye. Alright you guys, it is 7 o'clock a.m. right now. We are still on August 6th, Monday. And I just finished training my client, so going back home to grab my food. Ah, uh, to grab my food. Okay, so I'm excited for today. Every day is like different topics, different things to do. A lot of um, discussion, a lot of tears of joy for me. I am very sensitive. Every time we talk about something, I feel like I'm crying every time. Sometimes I just can't hold my cryness. <laughs> Alright you guys, I'm almost home. I will see you in a little bit. Alright guys, I got my food in here. All in. And I am ready to rock and roll. Got a little bit of coffee just right up to here. It's 7.20 right now. I have 10 minutes. Usually take me about 8 minutes to get there. Plus I put my lunch in the fridge. So by the time I get upstairs, it's 7.30. Let's do it. Today is day 11, you guys, of yoga teacher training at Bar and Soul. By the way, you guys, Bar and Soul is located at downtown Portsmouth. They do have different uh, branches, but the one nearest to me is downtown Portsmouth. But we're doing this yoga teacher training at Wright Church because if we do it at Bar and Soul, their studio, they'll be closed every day because we have to use the room for like 10 hours you know Monday to Friday so we're doing it at the church which is actually really nice because it's super amazing location there's plenty of parking we don't have to worry about paying for parking and also I like the echo on the actual building that we are in you know so it's it's pretty amazing love it love it love it love it I like that in the morning we do a little bit of like dancing like a sort of an activity to start the day and mostly we start our morning with a dance just like individually we just kind of like all dance on our own way it's pretty nice beginning of the day we have this um, sort of a ritual, uh, becoming a ritual, and uh, that's dancing first thing in, in the morning. 
morning, like first 30 minute, first 20 minute in the class, something like that. We dance and express and opening up and just welcoming the day. And I love that. I probably adapt that uh, even when we finish this training. I think I'm gonna adapt that and do that at home. Hey you guys, it's 7.27 and I'm here at the training place. <laughs> All right, I'm right here, I'm right here, I'm right here. Boom, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, let's go. Yoga teacher training, day 11. Here it comes. Mwah. See you in a little bit, you guys. So we're taking a quick break, you guys. We just finished um, practicing yoga and there's some hand balances and lots of twisting, really clearing up what's inside and it's just super challenging at the same time after the practice I'm like super relaxed so yeah we are doing the training downstairs this time because it's too hot upstairs it's gonna be really hot uh, today so we practice a little earlier because we don't want to get too hot later when it's you know like 90 degrees something but that was such a great feeling so I'm gonna go back now um, we just have a quick break so I'll keep you updated later you guys all right you guys it is 5 13 right now we're supposed to finish at 5 o'clock so we kind of like extend it just a little bit it was super amazing you guys today day 11 oh where do I start so let's start with the beginning of the class. Uh, we practice yoga. We're in yoga teacher training, so we practice yoga. I don't know how long it was, but I don't even count anymore how long because it's just super uh, challenging. And then when we finish, it's always like, wow, really, I just did that. And then it's relaxing afterwards. And sorry, I'm flashing and blasting my. Um, AC right now because it's 93 degrees Fahrenheit and yes yeah, so we did uh, yoga practice in the morning we talk about sutras I love the way Ankari explained it uh, really the analogy of a puppy it's amazing Ankari so much so much better easier to understand so if you guys know anything about sutras of uh, sutras by Patanjali, I'm pronouncing it wrong, but anyways, that's an amazing book, you guys. If you have time to read it, read it. I highly recommend. But Ankari explains it really in a very, very easier way to understand. So I'm glad that she explains it that way because I was reading and I'm like, oh, this is what is this? So that is the first um, part of the class, and then. We also, I'm going to show you, we also made our mala, this is our wrist mala, so I love it. So there's a meaning, or there's a meaning to each of these stones, I need to look at my notes, <laughs> so, because I don't know exactly, but I know this is for stress and something. Seriously, I don't remember because I'm too relaxed right now. Uh, the second part of the class, after we, the first part, with then um, we did Thai body work with Carrie. You guys talk about massage, talk about relaxation, talk about everything involves like just stillness and relaxation for me it's really deep I feel like this is another meaning of yoga you know to really get deep into yourself 
and also to give and to receive it's it's amazing we give each other's massages pretty much it's a Thai body work it's in a form of like an, a time style massage so we're pretty much lay down on the floor and Carrie showed us you know all this different sequence and how to give massages from the lower part of your body to upper part of your body to your head and that was super good it's like we give each other's like two hour massage I think oh boy that was magnificent fantastic fantastic and I feel like I have a calling for this I don't usually say this but my uh, friend my classmate in the yoga teacher training uh, Jen said you know that hey you have the calling for this and I did try to take massage class before I back up because you know I didn't have time for it I think I didn't even have money for it at that time and I still don't have money for it right now actually I don't know if I could take a full on two-year course of massage therapy but 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 this Thai body work in relation with yoga this one I'm feeling this I'm feeling it you guys I'm feeling it so we'll see where this brings me but for now I feel like I have that calling I want to to give that Thai body work I want to make someone feels really invigorating feels good feels healed if I may say that word but just to make somebody feels like mm, I love that feeling I probably love giving it than actually getting it believe it or not Jen was amazing she was great in doing it but I feel more of a Ooh, I want to do this. I'm like, Arr. it's amazing, you guys. It's super amazing. I love it. So, and then we ended up like just finished the class and we're like five o'clock. I'm like, oh my God, it's done. And that's the summary of day 11. <laughs> it's magnificent, amazing day. Ah, yoga teacher training, bar and soul. You guys rock 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 so anyways I'm gonna head home now I'm gonna drink plenty plenty of water because I need it I'm gonna blast my AC again so I apologize for the noise and yeah that's the day summary for day 11 Woo. Day 11, what a great day. Hey guys, it is like 93 degrees right now. Actually, it is 93 degrees right now. And it's super hot, super hot, hot, hot. Thanks, Papa. Papa and I are gonna go have a mini date. Actually, it's not a mini date, it's a date. We're gonna, we're gonna have a date. We're gonna go to like a surprise date. Thank you, Papa. So we don't know where we're going. We may go to Thai. We may go to something. Oh, we don't go. We're not going to Thai. They're closed. Sorry. Yeah, we're not going to Thai. Yeah, you know, I got a Thai massage. I want to go to Thai, but they're closed. All right, you guys, we are here. Look familiar? This place that we're going to is very close to the gym that I train my clients and the gym that I work at work out at so that's Vanguard Key Club right there you guys and that's 3S Arts and that's Barrio somewhere there so Barrio is like inside 3S Arts and this is our first time that we're going there we haven't been there
it's so hot. It's 90 something degrees, you guys. It's too fucking hot. It's really hot. Hot, hot. And we're full. <laughs> Papa, you're falling. Look, melting. we get to go. I'm melting. You're melting. Whoa, to go. Barrio, we like it. You like it, Pep? Ah, it's good. We love it. We love it. See you guys, Barrio is very close to Vanguard Key Club. It's right there. And Barrio is there. And that's Vanguard. I got cookie dough here. Papa copied me. He also got cookie dough. You copied me. I ordered first. Right. We'll go with that. I did. Uh huh. Cookie dough, yummy. They only have one size. They didn't ask us about the size, huh? Is it? That's it. Not too bad. Three fifty for this. Not bad. You like it? It's good. We're not returning it. Nope. We're not returning it, you guys. <laughs> There's no free sample, but it's really good, so we don't have to return it. <laughs> I'm so full. Look at that. I'm pregnant. Papi, I'm pregnant with tacos and ice cream. Oh my gosh. Ow. Uh, oops. <laughs> you may smell some part. Ooh, how pretty. What? Why am I going to get your shit on my hands? Yes. <laughs> so I smell. Ew. Now, hey, you know. It wasn't me. <laughs> you liar. <laughs> it certainly was you. Why? It's you. You fart. No, if I farted, I'd be bragging about it right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looks like you're trying to kiss me. What the heck? <laughs> what the heck is that for? <laughs> it's for your fart is what it's for. <laughs> You can just open the window. No, no, no. You could have just not farted. <laughs> Bobby. Yes, you farted. No, put that window up. Now it's hot in here. Bobby farts. Look, we'll pull up here. Yeah. Whoa. 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 Ah. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, don't squeeze me. I just ate a lot of food. No, no, squeeze me. You touch my boob. Oh, that was loud in my ear. Oh, your hair in my eye. Old people getting hot. Look at the sun. Mm. I love you, Daddy. Mm -hmm. Hi, baby. Hi, you guys. 
Papa and I just got home and my baby Sophie's not feeling good. She's having a little little diarrhea. She was a little embarrassed and she was like, Mommy, Mommy, wash me. And then now she doesn't want to get off me. So she just want to hang out with Mommy. Mm. I know, huh? How are you feeling, sweetheart? How are you feeling? You okay? She really is not feeling good because she usually doesn't like to be carried like this for more than two minutes. And I've been carrying her for like 10 minutes now. And I can sense that she's really just not feeling good. Yeah, I think she got a little belly ache. All right, sweetheart. Mommy's gonna take care of you. Okay? Okay? I love you. I got some reading to do for the yoga teacher training tomorrow. So I'm gonna read with Sophie. You okay? Let me just take a nap right there. Take a nap. Take a nap. Sophie. Good night, Sophie. Are you okay? Have a good night, guys. Say good night, Sophie. Good night. Have a good night, guys. This is my luck, my life, my love This is my destiny